Consider integers a and b such that a squared plus b squared is exactly divisible by 4. Prove by contradiction that a and b cannot both be odd. How to prove by contradiction? We always start with the negation of the original statement. You should write assumption or assume that but not let. And according to a problem, uh, for example, there exists something such that uh, something or something like that. And then you consider a statement from a problem, do some transformations or calculations so that you should get a, a statement which is not true. Hence, uh, a contradiction arises and therefore the original statement is true. And uh, for a given problem, uh, since it is given that A and B cannot both be odd, the negation will be that A and B are both odd. So we write, assume that A and B are both odd. How can we represent any odd number? It can be represented as 2 multiplied by integer plus 1. So then A is 2k plus 1 and B is, for example, 2m plus 1, where k and m are integers. 2 multiplied by integer it's even. Integer plus 1 it becomes uh, um, an odd integer. And let's consider a squared plus b squared. It becomes 2k plus 1 squared plus 2m plus 1 squared which is equal to 4k squared plus 4k plus 1 plus 4m squared plus 4m plus 1 and let factor out 4 from these four terms and get 4 multiplied by k squared plus k plus m squared plus m and plus 2 4 k squared plus k plus m squared plus m is divisible by 4 because k squared plus k plus m squared plus m is uh, an integer and 4 multiplied by uh, the integer uh, is a multiple of 4 and definitely a multiple of 4 is divisible by 4 but for k squared plus k plus m squared plus m plus 2 is not divisible is not divisible by 4 because the multiple uh, of 4 plus 2 is not a multiple of 4 anymore and uh, a conclusion this contradicts the assumption you may write in detail here therefore a and b cannot both be odd. And that's all for this problem. The next problem. Prove by contradiction that uh, this, uh, the equation has no integer roots. So assume that since uh, it is given that it has no integer roots, the negation will be that it has an integer root. So we write assume that there exists an integer root. Then actually there are a few ways how to uh, get a contradiction and uh, let's consider a given equation and move on to the right. So it becomes 2x cubed plus 6x is negative 1 and as x is uh, integer 2x cubed plus 6x is even and negative 1 is odd hence this contradicts 
the assumption and you may write in detail here therefore it has no integer roots another way we can consider 2x cubed plus 6x is uh, negative 1 and divide each term by 2 to get x cubed plus 3x is negative a half and as x is integer x cubed plus 3x is also an integer but negative a half it's a fraction it's not an integer and the same conclusion and uh, that's all for this problem.